नाइन सिक्सटी वन टू थ्री फोर फाइव सिक्स सेवन एट नाइन सेवेंटी यू सी वी डोंट वांट एवर वन मस नॉट बी लॉक्ड आउट एवर वन मस टेक अ चांस यू सी हाउ फिट द मेन इज हियर even you guys who train 24 hours you cannot go up to 70 let's push up and with my partner in training a man who is fight the challenges of our disability together with our coach we are able to do it sure two three four five six Seven, eight, nine, nine, ten, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, fifty. Hello guys, my name is Matheus Angula. Uh, I was born with no legs. I grew up in the village called uh, Ilambo, in the northern part of Namibia. Uh, I didn't grow up with my parents, so I just grew up with my my uncle. So, if my uncle taught me a lot of work, I used to look after cattle. As you can see, my hands somewhere here they are a bit dark because I was bending from walking around place to place with cattle. Boots. Yeah. Later on, I moved uh, to another to a different place where I went for my my studies. Where I started my grade one to grade twelve. Although by grade twelve, I didn't manage to, to get nice results. So after all, then I came to to Induk, where I went at uh, Trumpet College. I was studying uh, electrical and electronics engineering. Later on, again, I moved to WVTC. Where I'm doing the same course, electrical general. I'm a second year student. Apart from that, I'm a paral I'm a Namibian Paralympic swimmer. I went to different countries like Mexico, Kenya, South Africa. Yeah, and few, uh, a lot of them I think they will be coming. And um, apart from them, I like swimming. I like having fun with my friends and everyone that comes. So as long as you don't take advantage out of me. Uh, so apart from that, um, at, 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 my, uh, at my early childhood, it was difficult, especially like when I was looking out of the kettles, I was going uh, different places, and at that time it was sunny, so I used to bend my, my hands, so sometimes I was like walking on my, on my pubs like this, after all if I hear like, um, let me say, when the sun is bending, I used to walk on my, my fist, so yeah, I can say my uncle, it was, it was a challenge, but I can say on, on another side, I, I can say my uncle uh, developed me to, to a manhood, the way I'm proud of him, he taught me how to do it, and, uh, yeah, I'm strong. Yeah. Uh, as I told you before that I'm a Paralympic swimmer, through that I have challenges again, going to training, institute, very very hard uh, financial wise I don't need to have uh, taxi money to go to training and uh, sometimes even to go for games anywhere out of the country so 
I'm just asking out uh, any good Samaritan in Namibia who can help us out uh, to sponsor us with uh, maybe like transport money to go to uh, to training or even a gym where I can keep my fitness also. So by that you can call me at, uh, at my number and my number is 081 6313157. In, uh, in my community, I can say they are bad people. I see them good, all of them. They don't discriminate or they don't do what. Sometimes if they can see that they are yeah, making need help, they give a hand. So they are like my community also. They are very nice. My favorite place uh, in Namibia for holiday. I like going to the coast and have fun with my friends, swim a little bit. Yeah. Oh, the thing I like about my Namibian people, uh, they are very good people. They, they like peace. That's why, that's why even you can see that Namibia is a peaceful country that I can compare like within uh, okay, like to other countries in the world. Or even just, yeah, Namibia is a very nice country. So what I'm requesting for my Namibians is so just to keep, to keep up uh, that uh, spirit of togetherness and help uh, keep, uh, people with uh, physical challenges uh, that, I, that I, I, I can say like I saw how people are treating them. Uh, yeah, this is a good country I can say. People there they are very kind and good to people.